Joining us on Panthers TV with the GMB is new Panthers forward John Rowe. John, first of all, welcome to Nottingham. Thank you. It's uh, great to be here. Quite the trip, I take it. I mean, every guy when he gets is a little bit knackered. Have you been traveling for quite a long time now? Yeah, you know, I left uh, yesterday. Yesterday was my birthday um, and I left at 10 p.m. So it's been, uh, yeah, been quite the day and I just got off the flight and got here. So uh, definitely a little jet lag, but excited. Excited to be here. And we shove you straight in front of a TV camera. You must love it already. <laughs> um, so having a quick scan through your resume, uh, it's about five years now you spent in Europe. This would be your sixth. And with you having officially been accepted onto the Loughborough program, hopefully seven as well, uh, sticking with us two years. Um, have you enjoyed your time in Europe and looking forward to now some time in England where you can kind of use your English again? <laughs> yeah, I think you kind of just answered that for me. Uh, it's been... A great experience uh, spending five years in German speaking countries, living in their cultures, learning a lot. Uh, but I'm very excited to be uh, in an area where I could speak English and everything will be easier and be able to immerse myself more in the community and uh, in the town, uh, which I'm excited about. Now, the last time you played in the States, you were in the AHL, you were with the Rampage. Going through their roster, we're seeing quite a few names who've uh, appeared in the Elite League. You've got Josh McFadden, who's joined Steelers. We've got uh, Bavillier, who's gone to Belfast. But eyes are kind of instantly drawn to Tyson Strachan, one of the standout players in the Elite League last year. Having spent some time with him, what does it tell you about the quality of this league that a player like him was able to come over here and made such a big statement? Yeah, it says a lot about the league. Uh, he was a, a great player in the American League, had a lot of games in the NHL. Uh, he was a leader um, on and off the ice uh, when I was on the team with him. Um, and so it says a lot about this league and uh, you know the quality of hockey and, and the type of character that's uh, in this organization. Now, Rich has built a team that we haven't really seen in Nottingham in a long time. A lot of very big guys, a lot of what some people might call power forwards. You are one of the slightly smaller guys in there. <laughs> what is, what's the strongest part of your game and uh, what, what do you think you'll be bringing to this unit? I think this, the strongest part of my game is my speed. Uh, that and combined with the work ethic, I think, um, you know, builds who I am as a player. Um, I, I was seeing the signings as a lot of big guys, and I th think that's great. You know, I think uh, that'll clear up some room. And, and, you know, I may not be the tallest guy, but I also like to, to play a feisty style as well. So, um, you know, it should be a great year with, uh, with the squad that's been put together. Now, you haven't been able to see the Motor Point Arena yet, but we had Rich go in there yesterday and he was amazed at the facilities, saying it stands out even in the DEL as, a, as an incredible rink. Um, are you looking forward to getting a chance to first step on the ice out there? Yeah, I've, uh, you know, I, I saw a little bit of that video actually, and um, I've seen pictures of the stadium and it looks amazing. And yeah, I, I can't wait to get out there and hear the fans for the first time. Um, it's uh, very exciting. Now, just last question, obviously we touched on it, Loughborough. Uh, have you ever, I take it none of the other squads you've ever been to, you've been challenged with training and such a uh, high prominence MBA course as well. How, how do you feel about balancing those? I'm excited. Um, you know, I think when I was in school at the university while playing hockey when I was younger, I don't think I was necessarily prepared or as eager to learn at that time. Now I am. And uh, so I'm excited to go in with that attitude. Um, and I'm excited for this challenge to do both at the same time. I think, the, you know, you're always looking for the next challenge and, and this is the one that's now, so I'm excited for it. All right, well, John, we're delighted to have you. And uh, once again, welcome to Nottingham. Great to be here. Thank you.